I'm James. Today is very cold outside, but I got a very hot product. Uh, it's a full scan brand with a OBD monster, all protocol supported. It's a uni uh, it's a kind of the automo automatically HS and MS switch. You can see there is no switch uh, you, you, you can use. Uh, and here we got the package. Here are some tips. Uh, please do setting as below on for scan software before the test. Uh, click settings, click connection, choose MS can support, and choose RTS relay. And this cell, we open the plastic box, and we can find the card with the uh, for scan pro user instructions. Uh, it, it will teach you how to download the USB driver from the website. Also, you can choose from the screenshot of how to setting the configuration of the product. You can see scan QR code for tech support. If you have any questions or uh, when using this device, maybe you can get help from the uh, the QR code. Okay, and this is uh, some advertisement. Also, get started the one two three four five steps lunch app something okay here is the the main device the main device with the new design well uh it looks pretty good and with the uh, orange maybe orange color and with the usb cable there was no switch you can see here no switch so uh, it will detect the high speed CAN bus or middle speed CAN bus automatically. Okay, let's get on the car to test how it works. This car is a Ford Mondeo and we can easily get the OBD2 part here. You can find it very easy and open the cover like this. And you can find the OBD2 part with 16 pins. And you can easily plug in the the full scan into the OBD2 part like this okay make it firm and the another side here connect to the laptop USB and it will power on we download the full scan software from the the website and we unzip you can get a folder with a full scan name open it you can find some the CH 340 USB driver. Firstly, we have to install the driver. Double click and click install. And just wait for a while. Okay, which means the driver already installed. And you got to install the full scan, the software. You can double click. Okay, and we quit because we have already installed. Just a step by step, next and next. After we open it, we can get the software. Now we plug into the USB cable into the laptop USB, like this. And here you can see installing the driver USB server CH. 340 com 4 already you can see already successful installed now we open the full scan software the first thing you have to do is choose the settings as the user menu told you to the settings and the connection like this okay there is the connection step two and choose the rts relay like this okay so we do it connection choose the MMS can support, we choose the RTS relay, like this, this one. And we go bike here, we choose the click, connect to vehicle, like this. Demo model, switch to real model, yes. Okay, and it will check in Wi Fi, maybe the software support many. Okay, we can got a CAM4 and the EMM, ELM, the version. And the VIN number, the found the PCM. 
Okay. And we can go. We can see the LED right now is is on, and it's reading some of the. You can see here some of the, the the error code. And you see, would you like to see a profile of this vehicle? Yes. And it's already, you can see it's already read all the modules. Uh, IPMA something, you can see the IPC. And also you can choose the DTC, you can, you can see the problems here with the body control module and the ABS, something, okay. And if you want to read the lab data, you can choose the oscilloscope the icon and uh, choose the gear burning to I this some the information for example we add into rate and we add the DDM for example like this and choose the ticket and click the play button and you can easily find the something you can window It's down, you can see here, the rear left, left rear, down, down, up, you can see that. It's very easy to control and uh, just stop. And if you want to do some of the oscilloscope here, you can see the, also you can see here, the oscilloscope. It's very easy to use and uh, you can see once the signal changed it will change it will change okay anything you can see it will change okay so uh, the first another function something like the configuration and the programming if you want to come configuration coding uh, coding programming something you need the the license you can get the license from the fullscan.org by register the the mem uh, the member membership. Okay, now we already finished uh, almost all the functions of the software, and we tested with the uh, the full module, and it's from the 2015 or 16. I'm not I'm not sure. And uh, you can see this is a SYNC3, the model with the navigator. Also, you can enable uh, the hidden functions, the seat, or if you can enable some functions from the from the dashboard and by the Foscan software. Also, for this for this Foscan Pro Pro version, maybe all pro, uh, all practical supported from the OBD Monster, working really good with uh, with my car. Okay, thanks for watching. If you like my video, please make a subscription and uh, click the like button. Thank you. Bye bye.